Hey, hey, Sammy Do, the real estate guru. Not a guru, guru, one you never heard of. And that's by design. I don't really go bragging about this, but I've come across a major challenge in our profession that we've got so many new folks uh, being dumped into our community that's uh, really, really bringing hindrance and hurt to our profession. And so I'm here to tell you that you need a coach, not a course. Hear me again, you need a coach, not a course. You're not going to continue to YouTube your way to the top. Uh, you're not gonna be able to go to seminar after seminar your way to the top uh, because there are just certain nuances in the real estate business that you just won't learn without having someone been able to tell you about it. You don't know what you don't know. And what I am on a mission to do at this point is to uh, stop or do my part to help stop the damage that's occurring to the real estate wholesale industry by offering a hand up and uh, getting folks uh, coached up, mentored up uh, to be able to get their real estate business off the ground because there are real sellers out there, motivated sellers out there that are being damaged by new folks that don't know what they're doing. There's also many cash buyers out there like myself that are frustrated coming across new wholesalers, new folks in the industry that don't know what they're doing. And versus talking about it, in which we do, uh, that's human nature, I want to do something about it. But uh, I'm, I do not want to be perceived as a guru, nor am I trying to be a guru, although I will say I'm a real estate expert, and but I do my business for my business, uh, not to be a guru. I do my business to help people as well, uh, not to be a guru. So this uh, video is about that you need a coach, not a course. Listen, if you're going to build a real estate business and expect to make thousands of dollars, you need to treat it first of all like it is a business. And you need to invest in yourself to learn your craft. Uh, by that, uh, you want to be professional. I've got a couple of examples, kind of funny, uh, that I want to share with you, but I'm going to tell you this first of all. There are other professions that are high paying or highly decent paying or high risk professions. They all have a program where there is some type of coaching mentorship. A police officer goes to the police academy for 16 weeks. After they get out of the academy, they are placed with what's called a field training officer for another four or eight weeks or whatever that time period is for that department. And uh, they're not released on their own to, to go out and arrest people. They're carrying a gun and mace and an aft and, and handcuffs. They're not released on their own to go out there and do that. That's a high risk profession. It impacts a lot of lives. Guess what? They have a mentor, they have a coach before they're cut loose, okay? When a doctor goes to school, during that period, there is a two year period before they are even able to get a degree that they have to go through an internship, basically for two years, where they are working with another doctor and being mentored and coached on how to do a surgery and other procedures. That's a coach, that's a mentor. They call it an internship in that. Even a plumber has apprentices. A carpenter has apprentices. These industries impact people when, they're, when something goes wrong. You're not going to just learn everything in a classroom. You're not going to just learn everything in a seminar. And you're definitely not going to learn everything on a YouTube channel. Yes, this channel and what my company is offering now are the nuances, the services of the nuances that are uh, items that you just won't get in seminars and in coaching. Let me give you a couple of examples. Uh, I came across someone that was asking about, you know, I've been talking to a lot of motivated sellers, but every time I set up an appointment, they change their mind. And I thought I was pretty good with rapport building. Uh, and I don't understand why they keep changing their mind. I can't seem to get an appointment set for them to talk to me. <laughs> well, I, I decided to look at his social media profile 
Wow, who would have thought about that and why? Well, one thing I know as a mentor, as a coach, and not even as a mentor or a coach, but just as a seasoned professional, is that everybody looks at you on social media. If they're going to want to do something with you, even corporate executives like I once was, uh, will look at your social media. And if that looks kind of weird, fishy or whatever, you know, we may not do any business and you won't even know about it. You won't even get the interview. In his case, his social media, he had a picture that was of a, something kind of weird. I can't even describe what was in the picture. There was nothing in the social media that showed him to be a person. Uh, had everything else but himself. I don't know what he was hiding. Well, guess what? That's probably what his motivated sellers saw. That they, they want to deal with a person, not 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 you know an an image. You know, not not a company logo, not a cat or a dog. They want to deal with a person. So if you're trying to be in business and uh, you're trying to deal with people, you want to show yourself to be a person. Show yourself to be real. Just a small tidbit. Probably why he's not uh, getting calls uh, to, to meet because, you know, uh, he's, he's not really showing himself to be a professional. And so my first suggestion in his case would be dress up your social media. Now, you don't have to go and brag that you're an investor or anything like that. And in fact, I would tell you not to. Uh, and there's a different reason for that. I have a library of other uh, videos and things that you can check out to get some of those reasons. But... Uh, that's uh that's 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 one of those things that uh it, it's simple and, and you need a coach you're not going to get that from a seminar uh another example i would give you is that um I, I, a mentee that i just uh, signed uh, up uh recently um i came across a posting that he made in one of the social boards of the uh, one of the private ria groups real estate investing groups that i'm part of and I guess he became part of it. Didn't know him before I saw the posting, but saw the posting. And the posting looked pretty weird. I, I'm still not exactly sure of what he was trying to say, but he had the, the verbiage in that he had a property that was sub two. Okay, well, I know what that means, but he was also kind of asking for a, a little help on how to structure it and all that. So I'm thinking, well, it's not really sub two if it's not structured yet do you really even have the property yet so anyway typically when you see crazy posts like that they get ignored but in this particular case i decided to reach out to him and you know ask him a few little questions and uh, guess what he had basically saw a video from some real estate guru thinking that he wants to get in get into real estate and so he is aware of a seller that was a friend of his or an acquaintance of his that is in a motivated type situation and has this approached her about trying to help her and but he had no clue about what he was doing and because he heard the buzzword sub two he posted this false advertisement in this private social media group with real serious investors real serious cash buyers real serious players and it wasn't even an accurate post when i talked to him found out that first of all he's never done a deal which is okay but he definitely have never done a sub two deal which he kind of eluded to a little bit but the deal wasn't even under contract for one it's not sub two if it's not under contract for one <laughs> but for two is you didn't even talk to the seller about the sub two option they may not be willing to go as a sub two they may not be willing to do that um, but yet you're advertising that you have a deal that somebody might be interested in to go sub two who, who said that you just made that up well come and find out you just happen to discover that on YouTube University by some real estate big player guru and that was dropping that term and decided that he was going to go at it and so uh I, of course i i wanted to help the brother out and i uh, had him uh check out my youtube channel because i'm taking a different approach uh so subscribe <laughs> and uh had him subscribe but we also talked a little further and he agreed 
uh, that he wanted to hire me as, as a coach, especially uh, to help him out with this particular deal. Because at the end of the day, the seller that he described is a motivated seller. And it's, it's a real life situation. If you're going to take your business serious and make an impact in the world, you need to treat it with the seriousness that the business requires. If you're going to be, have the potential to make thousands of dollars, thousands of dollars, you need to treat it as a real business and learn your craft. You need a coach, not a course. You need a coach, not a course. Every successful real estate guru out there have had mentors, including folks like Donald Trump. Uh, everybody has had mentors. And so you would want to take a look at uh, my channel and my following and get some of those golden nuggets that you just won't really get from a seminar, from a guru. These are little nuances of things that, that can occur. And, and, and consider subscribing uh, even to my private uh, coaching group. And uh, also, if you want some one-on-one -on -one coaching, there are some options there to just reach out to me. But I've created this platform uh, to provide coaching and mentorship for those that haven't gotten their first deal, haven't gotten their second deal, that doesn't have a trend uh, in their business to get their real estate business off the ground. This is what this whole platform is about. I'm not trying to uh, get you know wealthy like some of the gurus that are charging you know twenty thousand thirty thousand or even fifty thousand you'll find that a lot of these gurus that are putting on these seminars on real estate are not doing real estate anymore especially in markets that are hot I'm, i come out of the austin texas market hottest market in the country at this point been rated the number one place to live for the last three years in a row uh, just a lot of great things happening here, but the real estate market is running at its peak. And these gurus and even uh, others, they're not doing as many deals in Austin as you would think it's, it, because it's saturated. It is The margins are slim. They're making their dollars off of these courses, these seminars. These, you know, They're getting the $50,000 from three or four different students that, that out of 200 folks that showed up for their, their course. That's how they're making their money. That's not my thing. I'm still doing the real estate thing as well as a few other uh, businesses. But um, it's my goal, my passion at this point to try to help you uh, that it may be struggling, that is wise enough to ask for help and to get help and to uh, help you get your business off the ground. It's, I want to minimize the damage that is occurring to the real estate profession. Uh, this profession has been around for centuries you know, uh, for generations and generations and generations. Of it. Unfortunately, with the social media thing, it's now really kind of gotten really, really big. And we need to really kind of pull, pull back the reins on it because what's happening as the industry gets damaged, regulation becomes heavier. And things that you could do, now you can't do anymore. And it's only because you got bad apples or incompetent apples out there doing certain things. So. Uh, if you, you're watching this, of course, you, you need a coach, not a course. Subscribe to this channel. Reach out to see how you can get uh, some one-on-one -on -one mentorship to help get your business going off the ground. Reach out to see how you can have even a much longer um, a relationship with me. Uh, if you like, um, look in the description subscribe follow all the social media stuff that you know you already know how to do uh, but make the connection to get help be wise enough in your business to get help don't be a clown don't be the one that thinks uh, you know you're so hyped up and amped up on the dopamine and in your brain that's making you feel good about being introduced to real estate that you don't recognize it to be an actual business and that you're not doing the things that's necessary to, to, to mold a business. Uh, this is a business, it's not a game. Uh, it's a high risk business and it's a high compensating business, but nonetheless, it's a business. You wanna treat it as such, get you some help, get some professional help, and that's what we're offering here. Uh, my positions, uh, my mentees are always evolving. Um, I, some are uh, 
successful where you know we've got some deals going on so they decide to go ahead and you know not need my help anymore which I'm fine with and some just quit because the work is too hard uh, it's not for everybody I'm not all about the glitz and the glam of real estate real estate is a very complex complicated and hard business but if you uh, can uh, push through that there can be some great successes but you also have to have the personality for it so um, subscribe to this channel book a one-on-one -on -one session with me if you like uh, so we can really talk about your business uh, I don't charge you know 20 30 40 50 thousand dollars but you know my time is valuable so I, I do require something for my time uh, so but go ahead and book an hour and then even then we can kind of talk about a further relationship as well um, but uh, if you like this information subscribe and follow uh, get the word out share uh, we need to put a stop to the damage that is occurring uh, to this real estate uh, profession with a, a lot of the novice and rookie situations that are occurring out there um, until then i'll see you at the top because the bottom sure is crowded